everyone from the Tabernacle of David Prophetic Dance Center in Jerusalem. It's a glorious day today because every day that I wake up, I have a thankful and grateful heart. It's a new day for endless possibilities and new adventures in Messiah Yeshua. And will we be found to praise and honor and glorify our God in Yeshua's name? Hallelujah. I hear the shofar. Do -do 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 from Jerusalem. I want to encourage you today to not allow the need for approval of your brethren, men and women all around you, your peers. You can experience peer pressure at any age. You can experience that. But not to allow that need, that human need for approval to continue to move forward in all that you were created for because the fear of man is truly a snare and proverbs 29 25 says that to us and that's become a major scripture in my life and ministry as the lord uses me with that little key to unlock every boy and girl in the adult man or woman that he brings to me to come and embrace our two innate worship gifts the voice and the body in motion is powerful instruments of praise and weapons of warfare and when we use those two together when we come as a child and embrace those gifts i've literally seen shackles fall away fall off of people people are literally transformed and thrust forward catapulted forward into their divine supernatural destiny dying to the fear of man is your key in moving into everything that God has created you for. I said yesterday, Dainu, we say at Passover, it means it would have been enough. It would have been enough if we were now were turned heaven bound to be with Yeshua and God and Holy Spirit that we have now indwelling us and empowering us is our guarantee that we will be with God. That is the spirit of the living God living in us here. Yeshua is seated at the right hand of God, and we are empowered by his Holy Spirit if we have received his Yeshua, God's salvation. So, Dianu, it would have been enough if we were just heaven-bound, but now we're in a position where we can come into everything we were created for. Because the scripture says, without faith in the Son of Man, Yeshua, we cannot live a life that is pleasing to God. I want to encourage you today to keep running, running, running into your destiny. And God is faithful. He will provide the people that you need in your life. And we will lose people along the way. Because as we continue to press into the heart of God and want more and more and more of God, there will be people that disappear from our lives. I think that's just the way that it is. But we don't have to worry because God is the best matchmaker and he will bring the right friends and relationships into our lives as we continue to move forward and be faithful to our God. In the name of Yeshua, God bless you from his great city, the city of rejoicing, his resting place forever. Yerushalayim.